I enjoy Labor and I reckon their current policies are doing quite well and all their, their aims are quite good and to f*** the Liberal Party off. <laughs> Scott Morrison, because I don't trust Anthony Albanese. And Albanese is a closet socialist. I want all the economic um, kind of policies that the Liberal Party has been advocating for to remain. Uh, you want to hear my view on politics? They're all f***ing, mate. Yeah, we're poor, we've got no f***ing money. We've only got $250 from the government today. How far does $250 go? How far does it go? Shopping for half a week, mate. Yeah? It's broken. The system's broken. Yeah? Uh, probably Liberal. I don't think they've done too bad a job. Um, and um, f I can't sort of figure out what the Labor Party policies are. The main thing would be cost of living. Uh, it's, you know, what's uh, what we've seen with inflation and, and, and the fact that wages have lagged behind is a problem. But if we keep moving towards full employment, the job opportunities will come and the, and the wages will equalise. Uh, I'm actually too scared to vote. You don't know what you vote, like, you don't know if your vote's going to go to what you're voting for or, you know. You're Clive Palmer, there you go. I think uh, he has a lot to offer, makes a lot of sense, a fair income Aussie. So for me, he'll be getting my vote this year. Sick of Labor, sick of Liberal, sick of the taxes and sick of the rubbish that there's been, that they've been um, advertising. Gunner, 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 gunner. But cost of living is getting hard, people are struggling, and we're only seeing the after effects now. Pretty corrupt. Pretty, yeah. yeah. Corrupt or crap? Corrupt. Corrupt. Yeah. They're corrupt. Yeah. I don't listen to any of them. Um, at this time, yes, I'm a liberal, so I'm, I'm voting for uh, Scott, uh, Scott Morrison. You know, I'm a liberal. It's got like, you know, they've got good policies, good, you know, um, yeah, good, clear policies, unlike Labour, so, and they manage the economy very well. Albanese is not bad, but I think Morrison hasn't done a bad job at all. A pretty good job, in my view, but then on election day, nobody knows. Um, probably Morrison. Just LBC don't like some of his views on like, I don't know, he's more focused on climate control and stuff like that. There's bigger things going on, like war in Ukraine and Solomon Islands, all that kind of stuff going on. So i got to prioritise, that's the way I think about it. Yeah, there might be a couple of Africans or Chinese or Indians representing, but it's overpowered by whites and they just don't understand like immigration. They don't understand people problems out there. Um, I'd be voting for Labor. Uh, I think um, Scott Morrison is a, a woman hater that hides behind his religion. Dutton's a minister for no souls. The deputy president, how's your wife and children and the mistress in Canberra that likes to preach about a moral compass for the gay community. Um, where do you stop with them, mate? I haven't decided yet but it's either one of the two big parties. Basically, whoever is going to favor a bit more towards immigration, I think. I think I'm gonna go with the Labour this time. Obviously, if they don't rip us off with, um, with the tax, again. <laughs> Probably more for the working class. So there's a lot for the unemployed, but the working class, I think there needs to be a bit more for them and businesses running and operating as well, small businesses. Yeah, that's what I'd like to see. It's not going anywhere what you're saying, so why waste our time and your own time? Stand down and give somebody else that knows their stuff a real chance and make a difference.